okay so uh, now we will find the window so it's, it was called embassy window window glass uh, it have a frame but uh, it's same like a the bed so I won't showing you that so wait it's a glass PSK so again we need to convert it to the uh, ace so I have some converted so I have here converted to assess some glasses so I will drop it over here and import it uh, okay oh, where it is uh, it, this this where it is okay you can see it only from one side okay so now we'll open this and uh, we will you no know, we will create some material uh, it doesn't you can find the material I think in the in here so I will try to do with this but I'm not sure uh, okay texture and create material okay so here what we need to do <coughs> is uh, add the diffuse and uh, opacity it's this and uh, we need to change the opacity for the material so we'll uh, choose this one you know it's behind it this one and uh, we need to find uh, opacity here material and we need to set it the uh, alpha composite I think oh yeah alpha composite and then apply it okay and uh, now we need to drop it on the glass and you can see it's transparent uh, you can see through but <coughs> you can select it now when you select this and you can select uh, the glass oh shit. you know if you don't have this it's uh, a low transparent uh, what is this something was low to pick up transparent things so now I can move with that but uh, you probably don't have uh, set it so when you want to choose the glass you can't so just turn on this and you can move with the glass so okay um, and uh, of course what you need what you can do is uh, in a material so you will open it and when you want to have it uh, both sides you know when you, you can see through this side and this side you just open the material and uh, find down here uh, two-sided so it will take uh, material on this on the uh, next side so you can just go here and here okay uh, so okay uh, I have said uh, some uh, some things over here and I want you to show how to create this whole mode so uh, uh, you know what in Mass Effect everywhere is some of these things so the first what you need is uh, the texture of that so, whole mode it's black and white so um, you can f uh, the name is uh, holo mode one uh, holo mode zero one and you will create from that uh, material and um, then you will add uh, uh, multiply and param node and the texture of course so the first how we will do this is uh, uh, open this texture so how you will create um, this uh, this thing? I will show you. So you you will first need to create this material. So add the texture of the holo mode. Uh, you can find in the in SFX I think. Uh, I'm not sure where are they. So I'll just try. Wait, I think I have. <laughs> Bio VFX uh, and the hologram, so environment hologram. So you will add this texture and connect it to the diffuse and emissive, 
and uh, then you will no wait so how to create this effect uh, you can find them in the uh, BOVFX uh, Enva hologram so uh, you need to extract that in the mass effect so what you will do is add the texture and create a multiply why right click mat and uh, add the multiply connect it to the diffuse uh, diffuse power emissive specular specular power and opacity uh, and then create a param node uh, so parameters and a new vector parameter and you just set the color what you want so maybe do red and uh, it will apply and it's red so uh, you need the uh, keyboards everything what's in the mass effect you can rebuild but I don't know how to make it move so uh, we'll show you just the static things uh, also you need to diffuse color to the B and the texture connect to the A and then connect so everything in the multiply so you will have this nice effect okay and you can all uh, you know you can drag it where you want and uh, scale it and everything so it will be all like in the mass effect so okay so the next thing what I want to show you to show you is uh, animation so I will start with my now I'm going to show you how to make an animation some characters so first what we will need to do is import our uh, model so I choose this one it will be called Medulk Medulk okay mm, now we need to create a new anim set and it will be called dance and uh, okay we we need to select our mesh so Medulka will dance uh, select anim and go to file and import PSA make sure you have selected our dance uh, and import the towny it's in the BOD sit hub of art flux deco in the anim sets so this will take a while until it will load so we are importing in the this anim set uh, all the animations so they they will be stored here um, okay it's done so here you can provide uh, all the animations uh, okay I don't textured her now because that's not important uh, so when we have done this click right uh, right click and new anim tree call it uh, anim tree dance uh, or what do you want uh, okay so now we have this selected and uh, go down and provide mesh list select our mesh and click on the plus and here oh, provide mesh this provide skeletal mesh and add the mesh now we can see the mesh that will dance in the in this animation tree uh, okay go a bit down and uh, provide anim set list so click plus uh, expand this and uh, select our anim tree uh, a anim set I mean this so it will go from this set and add one anim set uh, okay now click right in the free space and uh, new animation node and anim node slot uh, connect it and add the new input so it will channel 0 and 1 now we can close this and uh, click right in the, in here in the space make sure you have selected our skeletal mesh and add skeletal uh, mesh mat medulka so uh, double click on her or f4 uh, anim tree template uh, you can expand these two things the skeletal mesh actor skeletal mesh component and again skeletal mesh component anim tree template 
so we need anim tree this is this so add it over there you can close it now uh, open the kismet this is uh, the big k uh, it's open here down so uh, double click and new matinee double click on the matinee and uh, right click and add a new empty grab call it whatever you want uh, added a new anim console track so okay and again added a new anim console track we can add an, a new movement track but I don't, I'm not sure if I will use it we will see uh, okay here new group anim set so this is my anim set and I will add it so I will add two they will both the same uh, okay uh, now uh, select the first one anim slot name press enter uh, and select the, the dance what you want I will select this one as you can see the character is not dancing so what we will to do what we will do is expand this to the full even more uh, okay and uh, what we will need to do is select this the black square and you have here uh, the line is on the zero so we will need to expand it to one so uh, hold control and click and again hold control and click and drag up to one this is the smooth animation it's uh, going by the line so you can see she's not dancing and she's starting to dance okay she we have dancing her uh, okay now uh, go here no go here and when the animation here is ending press again control and again control and the second uh, square drag down by holding the control and dragging down so we have it on zero so the animation it almost stops and she's going again into the default position so uh, select the second anim slot and press enter and add uh, again some animation which you want we are now doing the blending animations so it's smoothly blended into another animation so we can again enable this and press this from the zero uh, up to one so as you can see it looks strange because because she's doing some weird uh, stuff like oh I'm dancing and now oops no oh, <laughs> default position and again I'm going to dance no so we need uh, we need this and uh, hold control and drag it like this it will blend so we need a really good blending and now you don't even know when she's going and what she's doing no default animation and she's dancing away oh uh, next thing which you basically can see uh, it's uh, she's not really good uh, standing on the floor she's like uh,